Praise be Jesus and Mary. Padre Pio, Saint Pio of Petrocina, may be one of the greatest saints in the history of the church, also had great devotion to Our Lady, praying hundreds of rosaries a day by a mystical gift that was given to him. And one day when a young friar came up to him and asked him, Father, what are your thoughts about Our Lady? He said, she is worth more than theology and philosophy. And why did Padre Pio say that Our Lady is worth more than theology and philosophy? Because we need to remember that our goal in this life is to become saints, to become holy and give the maximum glory to God. And one can do that without ever having studied theology or philosophy. But one cannot do that without having devotion to Our Lady. In February of 1937, St. Maximilian Kolbe was invited to come to the Seraphicum in Rome where the students of theology studied, the Franciscan students, students of theology, he was invited to come and to give a conference. And he did, spoke about Our Lady with great theological depth. St. Maximilian had a doctorate, had two doctorates, one in philosophy, another in theology. But the students said that after the conference, they said, what struck them most was not his theological depth, but was his spirit of prayer and ease of conversation with the Immaculate. This is what made St. Maximilian a saint, his intimacy with Our Lady, not his two doctorates. And so we need to remember this and we need to follow the example of our two patrons, Padre Pio and St. Maximilian, to cultivate greater devotion to Our Lady every day, striving to love her more and more, and to belong to her more and more perfectly. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please move.